We're taking a closer look at new video tonight showing a Grand Valley State University student hit by a rapid bus right on campus. For the first time, we're hearing everything that happened during the crash. 24 Hour News 8's Danny Carlson's been working this story since the crash first happened earlier this month, and she joins us live in studio. Danny? Brian and Sue, through the Freedom of Information Act, we obtained this video from the Rapid. And I want to warn you in advance you can both see and hear the young woman get hit. It's just after 7 in the morning two weeks ago. The Rapid bus is driving right along until. Oh. I'm calling somebody right now. I'm calling somebody right now. You need to be somebody out here. Need to... In one of the bus's camera angles, we can see the young woman in front of it turn to see it and start to walk faster. But when the driver calls for help a few seconds later, he says he couldn't see her. Got a student in my blind spot right in the front and coming with the bus. See a young lady, she was crossing the street. That the barrier right there with the window on it to my left, right by the mirror. I, it was a construction worker first. She came across and she was right there behind my spot there. Initial reports from police said the victim was not responsive, although we can see her moving around in this video. The bus driver paced and clutched his chest until officers arrived on scene. The victim laid on the street for a total of about five minutes until help got there, kept company by witnesses who stayed with her and covered her up. GVSU officials tell 24-Hour News 8 the girl had non-life-threatening injuries. We did contact the Rapid today. CEO Peter, Peter Varga says that it is not policy to comment on a situation like this one until they get the police report. He did not immediately know if the driver is still on the job since the accident. Hey,